Well, it's Miss Coors Light back in Daytona 2014 season. We're kicking it off. Daytona 500 qualifying, Coors Light Pole Award winner, none other than Austin Dillon. Tell me about your laps out there. Uh, I just can't thank these guys enough. They brought a really fast car to the test, and we were, we were a quick time here at the test. Brought it back, just tuned on it a little bit and uh, ended up on top of the board. So I'm so happy for them. We dodged some bullets for the other ECR engines. They were really close. The 78 was right there. So, wow, it's, it's pretty amazing. It's our first pole in the Cup Series and uh, couldn't be at a better place here at Daytona. So I'm happy. You join a very short list, including Dell Senior, who I grew up watching in the three. You join a short list of uh, pole winners for the 500. So that's gotta be pretty special for you and your dad and grandpa, right? Oh, it is. I got to see my grandpa fist pump up there. That, that makes your day right off the bat. So. Uh, just so happy and, and fortunate to be in this ride. Now, I, I want to know what you expect next Sunday at the race. I know you weren't in the Unlimited last night, but I'm sure you got to watch. What do you think is going to happen? How are you going to feel out there? Well, you know, it, it's, we got a different strategy to talk about now since we we, we got to bring that car to the pole. Um, try and learn how our car handles in the draft as much as we can without putting ourselves in a bad situation. And uh, definitely got some new strategy to talk about. So the Unlimited was wild, and I'm sure the 500 will be just as wild or wilder. All right, well, congrats to you. Very proud of Austin Dillon. Looking for a win in the number three for the Daytona 500.